Me and my friend John, we uh, wrote our master thesis regarding how to establish foreign internet companies in Japan. So uh, we went to Japan for half a year and we uh, studied the Japanese market and interviewed a lot of different companies. And when we come back, our professor said, so um, what is your conclusion? And we said, well, everyone talks about knowledge. Everyone says that if you really want to establish your company in Japan, you really need deep knowledge about the Japanese people and the Japanese market because they are really, really picky. So um, you really need to understand the local market. And then our professor said, so what is your hypothesis then? Well, you need deep knowledge about the Japanese market. And then he said, okay, let's see if this is knowledge or if it's just crap. And we were like, what do you mean? He said, if you want to see if you really have developed knowledge, there's a simple test called the tri triviality test. And um, what you do is you take your hypothesis and then you put a knot in front of it. And if you have developed knowledge, the knot hypothesis also has to be a valid option. Let me show you, he said. Think if I were a, um, a health coach and I were to say, tell you it's important to breathe. Is this knowledge or not? Well, let's test. Then I say, it's not important to breathe. Is there a, a health coach that would give you this recommendation? No, because you need to breathe. That means that this is triviality. It's, 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 I mean, it's common sense, so it's really no knowledge. Um, and then he gave us another suggestion. It's important to drink water. It's not important to drink water. That's also crap. But it's important to drink water before a surgery. It's important not to drink water before a surgery. Here you have two valid options. Sometimes this is correct and sometimes this is correct. So here we have non-trivial knowledge, meaning real knowledge. So this knowledge can help a manager or an employee to find the right way. So he said, what was your hypothesis again? We said, it's important to have deep knowledge about Japan. It's important not to have knowledge about Japan. And he just looked at us and he said, the taxi to Tokyo is waiting outside and he left and that gave me a lot of insight about how to develop knowledge because we talk so much about trivialities focus on the customer and sustainability environmental friendly but it's impossible to implement a happy customer or implement sustainability we need to make decisions or find ways to identify what are the true intersections that we really need to understand. We need to develop and understand what is our non-trivial decisions. That is my main takeaway from my master's thesis.